This is a view of a magazine page through a polarizing filter. The filter only lets through light of one polarization angle and blocks light with polarization at 90 degrees to it. Hence, one polarizer lets through 50% of unpolarized light, and two polarizers at 90 degrees to each other block 100% of the light. The view now is of two polarizers crossed at 90 degrees. One might think that introducing a third polarizer between these two would only make it darker still. However, when a third polarizer is positioned between the two and rotated to 45 degrees, some of the light gets through the front polarizer even though it's at 90 degrees to the back one. This shows that the polarizer is actually changing the polarization. This is a dramatic example of the measurement changing what is being measured. Light is made of photons, which are quantum in nature. Their polarization can only be parallel or perpendicular to the direction in which it is measured. All the photons passing through the first polarizer are vertically polarized, but their polarization at 45 degrees is not defined until it is measured. Hence half of them get through the middle polarizer. The experiment can be repeated with microwaves. The box on the left is a microwave transmitter based on a klystron. The box on the right is a receiver with an audio amplifier and speaker. The brown boards in between are the polarizers. Each polarizer is just an array of copper conductors. This is actually electronics prototyping board. The holes are not significant. The microwaves pass through when their electric field is at 90 degrees to the conductors. The transmitter and receiver are themselves vertically polarized. <laughs> 